Yo guys, what is happening? My name is God Disciple and welcome to a setup video. So before I do the video guys, I just want to give a big shout out to PC specialists who built my PC. So if you are looking for an upgrade, make sure that you check them out. Their link is in the description. Uh, but yeah, if you're looking for the full details of my build, uh, check it out in the description as well. So yeah guys, let's get cracking with the video. So first up guys, I have two Asus 23 inch IPS HD LED backlit frameless monitors. Now these monitors are beautiful and they honestly give such a crisp quality when it comes to gaming with a great response time. Next is the tower and PC specs. Now the tower is a NZXT Phantom 410 white gaming case. I love the fact that this stands out from your standard gaming cases but doesn't look cheap and trashy like some can. Um, I've got a single LED blue uh, strip in there as well which really shows off the internal components uh, from the side panel through the side window. Um, but in regards to the actual specs itself, the CPU is an Intel Core i7 quad-core processor, uh, 4GHz, 8MB cache, and the RAM is a 16GB HyperX Boost Dual DDR3. Uh, graphics card is a 2GB NVIDIA GeForce GTX 960, which is pretty good at the moment, but I will definitely, definitely be upgrading this soon. Um, I've got 2.1 terabytes of storage, which is plenty, and the cooling system is a Corsair H55 Hydro series. Um, and it's also got two additional fans in there at the top, which really does keep everything nice and cool. Now the mouse and keyboard that I'm using are both Razer. The uh, keyboard is the Black Widow Tournament Edition Chroma which has mechanical clicky keys and it feels fucking sick when you're playing the game and you're using this keyboard. Uh, the mouse is the Razer Mamba Tournament Edition uh, which is at the moment the world's most precise gaming mouse, it is so sensitive, it's awesome. And I've also got the Razer Firefly mouse mat which complements both the keyboard and mouse together as well. Now the speaker system I have is the Trust Titan 2.1 60 watt RMS system. I did a lot of research into these speakers and usually I am a brand whore, but the quality of these speakers and the support of their price is awesome. The headset I use is the Logitech G633 7.1 surround sound gaming headset, which is multi-platform. The headset has a really nice comfort with uh, soft over the ear ear cups, uh, which are removable. Now you'd have seen already that I'm a bit of a bright light fan, so of course this headset has the rear lighting system, which again is customizable. But yeah, the sound quality is awesome and uh, certainly the surround sound is precise, but the mic quality is pretty average, but that goes nicely onto the next part of the video. Now the mic that I use is the Rode Podcaster Fix to a shock mount and tripod. Now you will see a lot of YouTubers use this mic because it's a really good shotgun mic. Now shotgun mics are focused sound recording to the front of the mic, so it's really good at just picking up your voice. And to finish off, we have the lighting. Now the lights are USB LED strips. So you can buy them just fairly cheaply from uh, Amazon, um, but I've got ones which let off really, really little heat. Um, now the majority of my accessories you've seen have the custom light option, but it just really, really sets off the setup really, really nice. Um, but yeah, I'm really, really happy with the lights to be honest. So yeah guys, that's my setup. Now, <laughs> I never really thought that I would have a setup I'm this proud of. Like, I know, it's not the best and I know that there's going to be a lot of setups out there which just blow your mind but considering I started uploading to YouTube just using like the PS4 recorder and a shitty laptop it's it's crazy it is absolutely crazy but um yeah I, I hope it uh, gave you a little insight into uh, 
into me a bit <laughs> uh, and I hope you enjoyed the video um, but as always please do make sure that you like comment subscribe and uh, as always take good care and I'll see you in the next one bye bye now